All right, it is Tuesday. We got a couple things we're doing today. We have some deliveries to make of stickers. It's cool, some local delivery and some stuff going all the way to Europe. We have some coffee bags to photograph. Um, so we got the camera gear ready. So we are gonna head out. It looks like it's extreme wind. Let's get this week of riding started. <laughs> Luckily, we're not going very far today. Um, just downtown to get the shots and then a couple uh, other errands to do on the way. so bad. The wind is so bad I'm struggling to keep 10 miles an hour on the bridge. I don't know how I'm going to get these coffee bags to stand up for the shoot. It's literally not even fun to be out here at all <laughs> and I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get done what I came to do. But as bad wind as I've ever ridden in. I probably say that a lot on this channel but Chicago really has nothing on us this time of year. <laughs> I think that's the curse of uh, warm weather and late winter is, if it's warm and late, late winter here, it's just gonna be windy. So it's like, man, it's like headwind everywhere you go, it feels like, or the crosswind is just so strong that it doesn't matter. Well, it's Thursday and it's just as brutally windy, but it's also almost 65 degrees on the way up. So I guess I can't really complain on the way to another photo shoot. <laughs> Well, maybe I can't complain. It's actually kind of sketchy on the bridges again. <laughs> shoot went well just cruising around before I head over to the bike shop um, got some levers I want to bring in and see if they're gonna fit on the gunner vintage levers but yeah when I was parking my bike at the university uh, there was a student with their e-bike there and they knew me from the YouTube channel and Akron bike party so it was cool to get a chat with another cyclist and yeah gonna cruise around in the Sun for a little bit before I head to the shop
Friday today. We have the new winter cap from Party Size Cycling and my new 10 or new used 105 11 speed derailleur so we can get the rally back going. Now we're gonna head out and do some more deliveries, take some more photos, and see you on the road. So the wind has finally died down, but today it's only 31 degrees after last night's 60, mid 60 degree ride. So an interesting thing, yesterday I was photographing some students who were getting a scholarship. The scholarship is named in honor of a person who died trying to rescue people from a sinkhole that formed near a bridge in 1965, I believe it was. Well, the bridge is one I ride over almost every single day. So for an article, I'm going to get a photo of the bridge and the street sign. The road used to be called Talmadge, but they renamed it Memorial Parkway in honor of the victims. So yeah, when I was photographing the students, they were like, man, it'd be really nice to have a picture of the sign in the bridge for context. And I was like, well, I ride over it almost every day, so I'll grab one for you. So yeah, today's first part of the mission. So I guess they're also gonna get a plaque installed somewhere finally, almost 60 years after the fact. Maybe the city never did anything because they considered um, just renaming the street enough. But yeah, that's the bridge I cross every day. So almost every day. And this is Memorial Parkway. Oh, by the way, the title of this video, I guess that's something my grandma used to say to my dad. Go outside and get the stink blowed off you. Uh, seemed to fit for this week. Bye. 